Hey, so I wanted to do a quick little tutorial about how I clean up the audio in my videos sometimes. I'll use a combination of either Audition and Audacity depending on what I want to do and how extensive I want the effects to be. Um, but right now I just want to clean up some like hissing in the background from the, um, from the room that I'm in because it's just blank walls, tile, and super echoey. So if you listen really close, You know, there's a lot of stuff happening in the background. Um, so, .io if you ever have any questions. so what I do is I go and I export the audio, which is file, export, media, and click waveform, and then title it, whatever you want, click export. So I already have it in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select with the little mouse thing um, and then I'm going to oh you're gonna want to select a empty space basically um, and then you're going to want to go to effects noise reduction get noise profile this is what I have it set at um, you can you know make it up or down this just means the amount of um, how low you want it the sensitivity so like how often if it hears that like what is the threshold for sensitivity on that um, and then smoothing bands so that it can go in and out um, get noise profile and then you're gonna want to select the whole thing I just double clicked effects noise reduction click OK and then it will apply the noise reduction So see, it's significantly lower. Um, I'll play a side-by-side -side clip of it for you here. Is to feed the ultimate resource. To, is to feed the ultimate resource. So yeah, um, so that's what I'll do. And then I'll come back in here, import. Oh, I gotta save it. Duh, you gotta save it. Um, export audio, clean. File, import, and clean, and open, and drag or under, and I may just like mute this. Questions. Oops. That's not the mute button, that is the record button. Don't click that button, unless you want to like record over video or whatever. But yeah, so this is what we got. So it is significantly cleaner. Um, so that's what I do. If you have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comments down below. And I would love to hear if this helped you out. Make sure to give it a like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.